three, two, one. What's up everyone, Dan here, Crypto Capital Venture, July 11th, 2018. All of today's videos, including this one, are brought to you by special thanks to Eva Rasmussen, who says, you don't have good ears for that super high and tight haircut and to wear a hat backwards. If you have straight hair, I'd consider a medium length do. So special shout out to Eva. I will be I will be wearing and spotlighting my backwards hat today. So let's jump into the video. Obviously want to do a video on this news that came out yesterday. I did a video for Litecoin Foundation yesterday and we covered this, but basically partnership with TokenPay and Litecoin, buying a bank. Let's jump in and talk about it. So here's Jinji Wang tweeting yesterday we tried hard to open a bank account for Litecoin Foundation. Now we just bought a bank. If you cannot kill us, you make us stronger. I love that tweet. And uh, we can pivot over to Charlie's tweet originally that he sent out. I'm excited to announce that Litecoin Foundation and TokenPay have entered into a strategic partnership to buy a stake in a German bank, WEG Bank AG. We plan to work on many exciting consumer-driven crypto solutions. Stay tuned. So we can hop over to that happening. And there you see it. Token Pay and Litecoin Foundation announced an extensive crypto strategic partnership. Recently, Token Pay Swiss AG announced its partnership with WEG Bank in Germany. Under the terms of the previously announced deal, Token Pay acquired 9.9% of the bank, along with options to purchase approximately 90% overall of the bank pending the customary regulatory approval. Today, this 9.9% stake in WEG Bank was further transacted to the benefit of Litecoin Foundation in exchange for a broad and comprehensive marketing and technology service agreement to benefit TokenPay and its related cryptocurrency and business operations. As a result of this partnership, TokenPay and Litecoin combine as a leading force in creating and delivering to the market modern consumer-driven crypto fintech solutions. So goes on with the prominent addition of Litecoin as a strategic marketing, blockchain technology and logistics partner in WEG Bank and its longstanding partnership with Verge Currency, TokenPay conservatively anticipates adding several hundred thousand customers to its debit card solutions platform in the near term. Accordingly, the technical expertise provided by Litecoin will be a tremendous benefit to the establishment of the comprehensive of comprehensive automation guidelines and standards employed by the bank as it explores new market opportunities. I know I covered this yesterday in the Litecoin Foundation channel. You might have even heard about this news, but I really thought it was important to cover it here. But just right off the bat, my first thought is like something like Abra, right? Abra utilizing Litecoin, teaming up with Litecoin for their platform. Token Play, Token Pay teaming up with Litecoin. Because why? Litecoin offers incredible value. Uh, Litecoin is one of the most powerful cryptocurrencies in my opinion, and that's why I'm so I'm so heavy on Litecoin. That's why I cover Litecoin so often. It's why I volunteer for the Litecoin Foundation. I wanted to add to this video Jinji Wang, another tweet that he had uh, actually earlier today. It kind of plays into a video I did earlier today on Venezuela utilizing Bitcoin and why they're doing so. So he says, governments don't need to worry about cryptos. They should embrace instead. Eventually, their purpose is to help people to develop the economy and maintain social harmony. Cryptocurrencies accelerate trades, increase GDP and enrich people. They should be happy with cryptos. Now, what's crazy is, first of all, how true of a tweet that is. It's a powerful tweet and it's also a simple tweet that really sums up why cryptocurrency is awesome. But the one thing that is ironic about the tweet is as good as it is, we can't be so quick to expect that governments will do these things, that governments will embrace these things. Uh, I think in time they're trying to, but you, you could see over the last year, couple years, and especially at the beginning of this new technology, um, kind of just waving off Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies. Obviously, now that it's gaining some steam, attraction, and exposure, media exposure, uh, the governments are starting to look at it a little bit more. And it kind of plays into the video I did earlier on Venezuela, but really interesting. Hopefully, I mean, hopefully the governments 
have their eyes open and they're seeing what Jinji is saying here. Um, so anyway, wanted to cover that real quick. I thought it was relevant. Let me know your thoughts below on this token pay and Litecoin announcement. It's pretty big news yet again. Even with the markets down, all is good. Hang in there, everybody. I really do appreciate all of you coming by and watching. I really appreciate you subscribers out there. And I will see you in the next video. God bless.